the way that the crowd was reacting to Drake, it was like there wasn't a beef happening. Yeah, because it, because in reality, bro, outside of the people who care about hip hop, bro, you nobody like gives a fuck at all. They and they, they just want to party. There's some beautiful girl they want to dance with, and they want to yeah. dance to Drake. Yeah, God's plan is gonna come on, and then you're gonna fucking dance to it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He really did, he didn't give a fuck. Really? No, no. He, he was on. He was genuinely unfazed. Mm. I respected it a lot, and I talked to him. He didn't, that shit didn't bother him, as it shouldn't. He's the he's a fucking guy. But if I had seven hundred million dollars, you could. I would it, fucking. It got to it got to bother you a little bit. If you're you're an artist, you're sensitive. You like, feel I mean, the world. You I mean, I mean, you I, obviously you you. I don't know. I wasn't there. I, like I said, I was in Europe. Yeah. You know, I wasn't next to him. Like 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 how I usually do be. But but he was. I, when I would, I never saw him down. Yeah, uh, ever. I never saw him kicking his fucking foot, holding his head down. Hmm. You yeah. know? And then I, to a point where I just stopped talking to him about it. Cause it was because just, I felt yeah. like I was the one bringing him the negativity. Yeah. Like, I was bringing the cloud when I would be like, oh, man. Man, I hate that this person said this. And like, like it, I was showing him shit he hadn't seen. So then I started realizing, wait, I'm bringing you the negativity. Let yeah, me stop. But, yeah, I understand that also where like you don't want to ignore it completely and then you don't seem like an authentic friend who's right. seeing shit. Right, that's true. Yeah, um, but I just realized that he w his energy was, wasn't down. So I wasn't going to try. Bring him down. Right. Come on now. How you going to say that Drake wasn't affected by not like us? And shout out to Flagrant for calling him out, you know, Alex and Andrew Schultz, because there's no way that you're going to sit here and say that Drake was unaffected by Not Like Us. I mean, you can go to his Instagram and see he posted all types of memes and a story reacting towards it. And if he was really unbothered and unfazed by it, he wouldn't have reacted. You know, he just would have let it be and gave it no energy. And the fact that Yachty's trying to cover it up so bad definitely makes it look even worse than what it is. But what do you expect? You expect Drake to call Yachty and, you know, be down about it? Nah, it's just like anything in life when something's bothering you. You ain't necessarily going to tell your friends that you're having a, a bad day or whatnot. But do I think this is going to affect Drake's career moving forward? Most likely not. I mean, it's still summertime. Drake might still pull out an anthem or two. Who knows? I wouldn't really advise it right now. You know, I'd just step aside, let the Kendrick wave die out first. But I don't think Drake's going to be too affected by this. It's plenty of people that are fans of the music and not, you know, the battle rap. But anyway, let me know what y'all feel about it in the comments. And of course, if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.